We've all heard that shopping from bulk bins can eliminate a lot of unnecessary plastic and waste. And you've probably heard you can save a lot of money that way too. But how much money really? How will shopping from bulk bins actually impact your grocery budget? Well, I'm on a mission to find out. Hey you guys, I just got to Whole Foods Market. Um, I'm gonna be doing a bulk versus packaged ultimate challenge. Um, I have gotten a little taste of how much more affordable bulk food is compared to packaged, but I really wanna compare product by product. So come along with me. I'm gonna show you beans and rice and grains and lentils and oats and how they compare bulk versus packaged and how much money you can be saving if you start buying in bulk. We are gonna kick things off with the household staple, rolled oats. You can get these organic rolled oats in bulk for just $1.29 at Whole Foods. Then if you look to the package section, you can get them in these tubs, but the price doubles just because they're packaging to $2.65 a pound. You can also get these single serving packets in a box, but that actually doubles again and becomes $4.95 per pound just for oats. And if you're gonna get these fancy pants oatmeal in a cup, the oatmeal cost comes out to $20.32 per pound. What? That's more than 15 times as much as the oats should cost on their own. It's just insanity. Raisin prices at Whole Foods are very fascinating because they vary a lot. You can get organic seedless raisins for $2.99 a pound when you shop in the bulk section, compared to the packaged, which jumps to $4.26 per pound. And then if you get these mini individual packages, it jumps to $5.85 per pound. And for some reason, this other type of packaging is so expensive and it jumps to $7.98 per pound. Insanity. Organic green split peas, which are delicious in soups by the way, are $1.49 a pound when you buy them in bulk, compared to $2.99 per pound when packaged. All right, I've calculated for the rest of these the price per pound of the food, so I'm gonna let those speak for themselves. I hope you guys enjoy. All right, so now we have some items that either do not vary in cost between bulk and packaged or that actually go down when you buy packaged. So of course this is just Whole Foods, one shopping trip, but take a look. you guys I hope this was helpful for you I know I learned a lot and this is definitely gonna impact how I will be shopping going forward um, I hope that you will all check out various grocery stores in your area that offer bulk bins Whole Foods always has great bulk bins Sprouts farmers market is becoming more and more widely available they're opening stores all over the place they're a great grocery store with huge bulk bin section so that's really awesome and any natural food stores almost always have bulk bins 
them. So if you just Google natural food stores in your city or your area, hopefully you'll find something that comes up that you can check out. If you're ready to start shopping in bulk, there are two things that will make that so much easier. The first is getting several of these reusable shopping bags that you can just directly pour the beans or rice or anything you're getting in bulk into these. Um, these are cotton bags that I got on Amazon. They're really affordable. I'll drop a link down below and yeah, they're awesome. I can reuse them forever. And then when I get home, I pour whatever I purchased into these mason jars. And the type of mason jars that I get are these ball wide mouth one quart mason jars. You can get a big box of like 12 of them for maybe $20 on Amazon. I'll include a link for that below as well. And these are awesome. It's really important for them to be wide mouth so that you can get in there and clean them really easily. Your whole hands can stick in there. Um, and I just love these. So I highly recommend picking up a few if you plan to be shopping in bulk and yeah, that's it. Then you're ready to go. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, found it helpful. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. That really helps out my channel. And if you want to help even more, drop me a comment down below. I also just love hearing from you. So I'd love to hear if, is this going to change how you shop? Um, are you going to start trying to shop in bulk? Uh, what did you learn? Let me know down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a beautiful day and I will see you in the next video. Bye.